Hey guys, we are back in the cockpit of DCS today, and today we're flying a different aircraft than last time. The F-18 is a awesome aircraft, and you're definitely going to see more of it, because flying air-to-air -air combat with that thing is just amazing. But also in these game modes where I'm flying air-to-air, -air, there's a lot of problems on the ground, too. There's SAM missiles, there's also objectives with, like, vehicles and different things we need to take out. There's a lot of stuff, not just in the air, but also on the ground, that aircraft have to deal with in these multiplayer servers. One of those things is enemy SAM sites. Big SAM sites that can shoot these telephone pole sized missiles at your aircraft. They can go up to like 30,000 feet and still splash your fighter aircraft as they're trying to, you know, clear out the skies. And so something has to be done about them. This is when a plane like a Su-25T Frogfoot comes in. This is a plane designed for things like the suppression of enemy air defenses or better known as SEED sort of operations. This thing can hold a ton of rockets that can shoot down upon enemy uh, air defenses and stuff like SAMs and such, but it does also have slightly a disadvantage to the F-18. It is slow. Extremely slow. Yeah, I'm stalling in the trees. Mm, I couldn't make it over the mountain, no. <laughs> I'm down. So in today's video, it's going to be pretty interesting because one, you're going to see me learning how to use the SU-25 without much, too much, you know, uh, defenses, and then you're going to see us have to deal with other aircraft coming after us as the Su-25, which is pretty difficult. From long range, we're going to turn yeah. around. Yeah. Okay. Over mm -hmm. here. Huh. Way. Yeah. And this. Mm -hmm. We can do. And there's yeah. always okay. a need for here. Mm -hmm. We're looking at a yeah. view. Yeah. Radar. Mm -hmm. An example. Okay. So you'll. Yeah. And then this Got goes. It. Uh huh. Just. Huh. Okay. So the altitude and to take out these guys. Okay. They're trying yeah. to care. If it's mm -hmm. just you, it's yeah. more. Yeah. So you can. Mm -hmm. So you see how this is starting to get a little bit complicated. Yes. The four of them. Mm -hmm. But the really good. Five, they're yeah. They're like the equivalent. You know. Yeah. Uh, M P U. Got it. Got it. Mm -hmm. Cover that range. Missiles. Okay. Bastards. Mm -hmm. Okay. We can engage and push the throttles all the way to idle. Okay. If your thrust, if you look at your your stick in the cockpit, mm -hmm. just to its right, you see like a uh, plane symbol. Looks like a big twenty-one. Yeah. This is the Russian rare warning receiver. <laughs> um, it that is, is archaic. Super. <laughs> just to its right and below, there's that picture of the plane again. You have your three green at the bottom left, right? Yes. Cockpit's a lot more restrictive views. I feel like I'm driving a Camaro yeah, compared to a Corvette or something. But you'll notice when we're doing a siege strike, it actually it's going to be like, oh, this is so much Really simpler. nice. Especially once I teach you how to do it in the F-18. You're going to be like, wow, the Russians huh. actually have it easier. Yeah, I mean, the huge targeting display TV there, I bet is very nice. Now, you see in the upper left corner, you see 80. Mm -hmm. That's your knots. Um, same restrictions as the F-18. Uh, you're going to see 80 as the lowest value. Got it. Until you're going 80 or above. And then underneath it, you see a little triangle. If it's in the middle, it's telling you you're moving at a constant speed. You're not increasing or decreasing. If it's to the left, you're decreasing in speed. If it's to the right, you're increasing in speed. Okay. So it kind of lets you know if you're accelerating or decelerating. And that only turns on once the speed is alive, I'm guessing? Uh, it actually works right away. Oh, okay. <laughs> I don't know if it's got accelerators, accelerometers that detect it or not, but... Huh, okay. But thank you for letting me know. Is he doing a wheelie, or is that uh, just me? Looks like that has to be network. <laughs> oh, wait, 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 what? Ooh. Oh my God. Okay, let's taxi up. I think he wants to take this taxi way out. So. Okay, how do I get some Windex for my uh, glass here out in front of me? Uh, Call Vladislav and tell him to get on the canopy. <laughs> Seriously, like, Start what? Scrub it. What is this? Oh, uh, it's disgusting right now. Around 300 kph. Raise the nose up. Got it. And gear up immediately. Oh god, I gotta sneeze while I'm taking off. 
And right turn out. Copy. Mark's Chevy, one, two. Continue taxi. Can I just Yeah, Max. Bob, one, one, much. And flaps up. Inbound, runway. Copy, flaps up. Watch that sync rate. You'll notice that uh, rate of descent's gonna drop a little bit yeah, when you do that. Yeah, I felt it. Or yeah. Heads up display. Ooh, and a lot of little crosshairs Later. below. Okay, so if we pitch down really quick, uh -huh. I'm gonna pitch down so you can see. Ooh, that's you cool. See all those diamonds. Those are all radar signatures that you can oh, lock oh. up. That's awesome. Okay, so let's take a look. Uh, let's see. I see a lot of. I don't know what they're gonna look like for you. Fuck, this is terrible. They're S's for me. Yeah, a lot of S's and KY6. Okay. S's are search radars. Okay. They're just general purpose search radar. They are not a threat to us. All they're doing is they're uh, relaying information to the SAM network. Yes. So don't engage S's. It's a waste of missile. Okay. Now, I see. Do you see SA6s up, up ahead? I see KY6s uh, front right. Kind of. Uh, there's three of them between 1S between and... the S's, right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so those should be your SA-6s. Those are the uh, Tunguskas, I think. Okay. Uh, those guys, definitely, they're anti-ballistic missile guys. Okay. So right now, I'm locked up by one of them. Yes, I am. Okay, so if you take a look at your... Oh, well, it blinked out. Yep, same. So if you look at your radar warning receiver, um, at the bottom row of lights will tell you what type of uh, threat you're looking at. Okay. So the very left one is an aircraft. So right now it's telling me that the very left lamp is lit up, which means it's an enemy aircraft, okay. and it's showing up a little light at the very like 1 o'clock position of my aircraft, 12 o'clock position now. Yes, I see it as well. And then you see that little uh, circle around the aircraft? Mm -hmm. That shows the signal strength. <laughs> so right now it's weak. Yeah. It's only three bars. Now it's switched over to another one to our two o'clock, and it's very strong. Mm -hmm. Whoa, I'm tilted way left there. Right, excuse me. So that kind of tells you what's what. And now I'm getting locked up again, and it's one of the uh, lights in the middle with an X over it. I believe that is a long-range SAM. Okay. So there's long-range, medium-range, and short-range SAMs, and that's kind of what tells you where... Uh, what type of aircraft is locking you. But you also have to make sure that you know which zones we've captured, because if you start engaging friendly targets, uh, you can lock them up and you can shoot them because they're just radar emitters and they, there's no IFF from these missiles. So you have to make sure that what you're shooting at is actually hostile. <laughs> gotcha. Um, and one way to know is which type of units there are. If it's a Patriot missile site, that's US, that's ours. If it's a Hawk missile site, that's ours. Oh, missile from the uh, SA-6s front. That's hostile. Yep. Go ahead, Metric. But that's not an SA-6 because oh, it's it not over a diamond. So there's there's like an SA something else there. I see SA-8s are popping in now too. There's a bigger cluster on the left there, left of the missile line. Got so it. once we get close, we're gonna start seeing all of those emitters and we're gonna deconflict. I'm okay, just gonna okay. say you take the left group and I'll take the right. Oh my god, do you see all those SAMs? Oh I see uh, like six or seven straight front. Is yeah, so I think what we're going to do is we're going to double up on them. Got it. And you're going to work left to right, and I'm going to work right to left. Okay. We'll saturate it that way. And that airfield, the double airfield you see on your left over here, um, that's going to be our uh, landing point. We're going to re refill. Got it. Getting a beeping tone now. Is there a flashing light or anything on your yes, radar flashing receiver? light? Okay, that's coming from our 12 o'clock. Listen, they're engaging yep. already. Okay, go ahead and make a defensive maneuver left. Just do a quick 1 8 and pop chaff if you can. Uh, flares. I'm on your 6. Uh, you have multiple now. Go ahead and make a defensive maneuver down into the ground. There's at least f four missiles after you're at.
still tracking, still tracking. Okay, go ahead and pull left. Keep turning back towards the SAM sites. I'm uh, still on your side. Okay. I think we're defeated at this point. Yeah. Oh, went high. Yeah, they weren't going to make this too easy for us. <laughs> mm -mm. So, if we can't get there close enough, we might need to do a low altitude engagement. Uh, those contacts were bearing 120, correct? Or am I off? Uh, negative, to the left of that. That's a further SAM cluster. Gotcha. Yep, oh my god. Right. Holy jeez, what? <laughs> Where did that come from? <laughs> yeah, this is going to take a while. Right, I'm almost ready to squeeze unless they... Oh, missile. From the right, Sam's. I'm going defensive again. I, f I see it. Diving. Left. Oh, multiples, multiples. Times three, times three. Okay, let's do that same loop, and we're going to need to go in and do a low approach. Got it. Looks like this is going to work at uh, high altitude. Woo, look at the amount of missiles. Oh my god. Yeah, Good these minus. guys are not choking around. <laughs> Good times. They're still tracking. They're still tracking. Yep. I'm bouncing on the weeds. Okay, turn back in. Copy. Turning left. So you and uh, let's stay low. Yeah. Copy. But I'm talking like treetops low. Okay. Diving back down. Jeez. <laughs> yeah, I wasn't quite expecting that. <laughs> Thanks for the first be a lot, flight. But, yeah. It's a good time. I, I told you that some of that are just not going to appear until you get close, you know? Good tutorial. Yeah. Even lower. Much lower than this. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you going full throttle this whole time? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Full okay. throttle. In order for them to crash the missiles into the ground, you might need to pop up yeah. and then go straight back down into the ground for it to work. I understand that. Oh, I need to get my trim different. So if up. you uh, start getting shaking, it's because you're going too fast. Got it. I'm going to engage the group uh, far right. There seems to be three main yeah, groups. Those and are the, the closest. The far right ones seem to be closer. Kay. Let's focus on that together. I'm just going to squeeze on the left. I'll start right to left. You go left to right. Copy. Squeeze. Fire. Ooh, did I shoot? Nope. Now I'm, we're in range. I'm uh, shooting, but not shooting. Yeah, I'm not shooting. I'm going to wave off and double check that control. There's not a manual or uh, Okay, turn that turn around. There's not an arming switch, is there? Nope. Yeah. Yeah, didn't and, that. But it was trigger, right? Yes. You mapped it to the trigger and press and hold. Press and hold. Yeah, press and hold. Okay, I was just doing kind of quick clicks. No, 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 no. You have to press and hold. Ah, okay. All right, I'm going to turn around then. Try a second yeah. time. I launched all of my missiles. Looks like they're trying to intercept. There's a lot of missiles in the air right now. Got it. Turning around for it. Yeah, it looks like a low approach might be the way to go. Yeah, because I'm not getting shot at anymore. Oh, those are wrong targets. Yep, okay. Fired. That's what it was. Okay, two missiles out. Turning around. Oh, you can fire all of them. As many as you can. Okay. Well, too late now. I'm still going to turn out. around. Yeah, just because I'm spooked.
I'm so much faster than you now because the missiles are gone. <laughs> they have so much drag. <laughs> yep, I got a uh, something killed. Nice. Is there a way to hide the little kill fee that pops up? I There should be because that's annoying as hell. Yeah, I wish it was not a thing because it always is a spoiler of like, Hey, you killed that aircraft that you stopped looking at. So yeah, like, yeah. Oh, thanks. Um, once we've uh, you released the rest of your missiles, we're on our way back and land. We'll, uh, I'll ask over the radio. Got it. Two, 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 start info stop. Uh, there's still a target on the right. Is he close? Oh, yeah, he's close. That's A8, right? I uh, can't tell. It just says yeah. Oka for me. Yeah, it's probably the Osa. That's it. All right, get rid of those guys. Yeah. That's so awesome. To watch. <laughs> oh, that one went in the water. Too low. Okay. Okay, that's RTB. Yeah. You gotta uh, get more missiles. I don't know if I felt that. Did it land right below me? Yeah, and okay. splashed water way up. Uh, <laughs> should be no shrapnel, but yeah, you want to make sure, because that thing drops the, uh, the gotcha. missiles into the ground, okay. and then the motor kicks. Yeah, I feel uh, like just I... Just uh, 270 for now until we're over land, and we'll pop up and try and find our airfield. Copy 270. It's good practice, Dodd. I mean, we can do this in a PvP server if you want to make things a little more interesting. I haven't even tried PvP yet. I've been just doing purely PvE. I mean, this is good to just get, like, the ropes up, you Yeah. Know? I'm gonna land a little bit early. This is fine. Uh, don't use parachute if you don't need to, if you feel like you're gonna slow down fast mm -hmm. enough. I don't even know the control for it, so... Uh, be P for parachute. Okay. Yeah, I'm fine. Just, uh, yeah, tap that W and hold it. Yep. You're not going to burn the brakes out here. Because uh, you actually, in order to get the parachute back, you have to repair the aircraft, not mm. rearm. So it's that's a pain in the butt. I use it more as an emergency than anything else. Yeah, we're fine. There goes the Fox 2. Yep. Oh, so it's gonna close. Hit it. It's going to hit it. Oh, nice. Yeah. Oh, that sound. Jeez. <laughs> Keepler makes amazing models. Damn, that's This wasn't done by ED, this is a uh, Heepler, it's a third party dev. Huh. Wait, and <laughs> you are rolling, you are rolling 180 degrees left and right instantly, like, what? <laughs> I'm just gonna go. You are sideways on the run, you are absolutely sideways. What? <laughs> what? This server is just not doing well. Are you, you're taking off. I'm right now, right? Yeah, I'm taking off right okay. now, so I'm <laughs> just trying to get out <laughs> your of your nose way. Your nose is looking towards God right now. You were just pointing straight from the sky. Whoa, the missiles. Okay, I think we're actually going to need to work the guys in the far left. Copy. Looks like. Yeah, two SA-15s or something, and then there's like a bigger cluster just to its... Yep, eyes on. Uh, I'm going to engage the two guys on the left. You want to work that slight yeah, bigger cluster three on the right-hand side. Got it. And I'll, uh, I'll dump my missiles in there as well. Okay. And I think I'm going to start getting lower. And go full, 100%. Yep. And remember, once you start firing, pop up a little bit, or your missiles are going to dump in the water. Got it. But uh, get a little lower. I think I've got a missile on me right now. Checking. Yep, my right, I think. A firm. That's going up. Hmm, I don't know, but I'm getting locked by it right now. Yeah, it is shooting at me as well. I'm just gonna go for it. Those guys are so far away, though. Okay, 
turning left. Okay, outbound. Pop massive chaff as you're jinking left. Got it. You got one inbound on you. Copy. Everything's kind of frozen right now, so I think we might be okay. The lag might be helping us. <laughs> yeah. Okay, I think I hit three different targets, four targets there. Nice. Damn, right there. That will be a visual, and it opens up into a huge mass river. We're going to follow that as it curves to the right to the northeast, and at some point we're going to need to make a left turn and go into that valley Got it. that goes to the west, and it curves west, and it goes southwest, and that river follows all the way into Sukumi Babashara. You see that? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I see it. But as long as you're really quick with firing off all of your uh, missiles and turn back around and dive down behind the hill, we should be okay. Okay. Before we forget, put our ECM jammer on. So we're up. ECM jammer. Uh, is that an IR jammer? The IR jammer. Yeah. Okay. Sorry, not ECM jammer. That's that's my bad. Ralphie making a mistake. Drewski correcting just, Ralphie. Just just edit that out, okay? The the <laughs> Padawan becomes the master. <laughs> and easy on the turns here. We are so fat. Yeah. Uh, a lot of people like to think, oh, it's like a fighter jet, and they like take off, raise their gear, raise their flight, their sink rate drops <laughs> tremendously, and they tilt the entire aircraft right and just crash right into the ground. All right, so the dam is off right below me on my right hand side right now. Got it. Oops. So, a nice little visual marker. So pretty. Okay, I'm going to dive in just a little lower. I want to be really in between these mountains. Okay. Because uh, we're still getting signatures. Right now, the signatures we're getting are behind us, so those are all friendly. But if yeah. you see a, a nail come uh, somewhere in front of us, that's bad. Okay. That means someone's really high right in front of us and he can see us, or he's really close. Yeah. So that signature, you see how that arc is pretty close. It goes, it wraps from the bottom right and it wraps all the way to the upper left corner. Yeah. That's a pretty decent strong signature at that range. You're pretty much within missile range of an aircraft, especially if it's head on. All right, so uh, don't worry about flying next to me. Make sure you're flying behind me in trail formation. Okay. So trail behind. And at some point we're gonna need to like kick 100%. And if you need to trim up, like, you know, do what you gotta do, right? Yeah. Make your life a little easier. So do you have a hotkey set for the air-to-air, -air, the longitudinal? Uh, I believe so, yes. Yeah. Okay. So I don't know if I mentioned, but uh, uh, trimming is rather important, the, the aircraft. Mm-hmm. Uh, you will get a few knots faster if you trim the aircraft properly. Okay. Otherwise, your trim is going to be fighting your elevators. Got it. So it kind of helps. And not, not extensively, but, I mean, you will get a few knots out of it. Yeah. All right, there's the valley to the left. I'm just going to dip down because uh, we're picking up all those radar signatures right now. Yep. That's what I don't want to see. I'm throttling back down. Okay. About halfway in the dive. And we just follow this river as it's gonna curve off to the left. Okay. Which I can't see because the guy. I, didn't yeah, <laughs> that is nuts. <laughs> it's yeah. If you tilt your head down below, because there's like glass over glass at the top part of the HUD. Yeah, I see. If you what tilt you your mean. head down, you can actually see. Who <laughs> take a look to your left? Do you see that four ship? Yep. Or <laughs> Jeez. Those are friendlies, right? Friendlies. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. Jeez. That's that's just like something you don't want to see. That's good for us. I mean, everything yeah. will be take distracted the attention on away that. From yes, yeah. exactly. Sunrise on 
Shit, we're getting locked up. Yep. One o'clock. Roger. The uh, nearest hornets are now about 15 miles, 273. Um, two have turned cold. Defensive. Still Defensive. Got it. He said 15 miles. I don't know if I'm going to make this. Jeez, yeah. I'm going to have to turn. Mm. Missiles are still inbound. Popping shaft, turning around. Yeah, that's really rough. This is a 20250 for radio check. I don't know if you lost me, I'm zero, uh, uh, four, zero now. Yeah, I'm gonna come back to you, I have to climb a mountain first. Yeah, it's... Very iffy if we're gonna make this. Oh, jeez. comes a missile. Oh, splash. Oh, someone just got killed. Jay. Yep, saw that. Saw that. Well, the radio signature disappeared at my 12 o'clock, so I'm hoping that was a hostile. <laughs> I told you that this gets a little bit crazy. Alright, let me see if I can see you through the poop stains on my HUD right now. Uh, where are you Once heading? Once you get out here towards the opening, it's going to be 221. I'm getting locked from one. Clock somewhere. We're going to try and take this opportunity now. Alright, so that uh, radar signature to our direct north, that's the Eagle. Okay. He's 20 miles. Hopefully, if I stay low enough, I might be able to get around this guy. You are still on that same valley, correct? Yeah, I okay. made a left turn once I hit the opening in the valley. Gotcha. Two, two, zero in between some mountains. Okay. And I'm disappearing off this guy's right. Got it. Level magic, there is a hot Okay, eagle. here we go. Uh, Popping up. Two, uh, two for okay. 22, 23,000. That is pressing on too friendly frog fossil. If you can uh, assist that. Here's a try. Oh yeah, I see your trail. I see you now. Yep, you fired. Ooh. Level magic, that band is now 275 for 15,000. There are an additional Tomcat and Hornet to your north. Are your missiles locked in? You Fox and Scoot. Or nope. I don't know what I'm saying. Are you flaring? Yeah, there's a IR launcher right here. Got it, okay. So I'm turning back around. Level I'm magic, done. About to be okay. By the eagle on your west 10 miles. I'm gonna try to the same maneuver. Uh, for Tiger. Uh, Dagger magic, that was... For level, the eagle is cold to you now, 350 for 10. If you guys can exfil, say 100, it'll push you away from them. Affirm, Dagger 1 1 completed his run and RTB back in Valley. Dagger 1 2 is inbound now, and uh, we're gonna uh, go inbound east. Thanks. Alright. Dagger Magic provides your value may be compromised. Eagle 360 for 9, 19,000, turning hot. Additional Tomcat 03 for 13, 12,000, merge with a friendly Tomcat. Thank you. All right, just head straight back, like uh, zero three zero, back in the same valley. Got it. Uh, we have one eagle within uh, nine miles, and another one within fourteen miles. The second one's uh, entangled with a friendly, and that eagle that's closest Thank to us is uncontested. Magic, that eagle is passing your nose. Zero three zero for five miles, eighteen thousand. Go over your head. I'm gonna dive really low. Understood. He's right above us. Five thousand. I have no eyes in this guy. Yep, no eyes. Said he's north. Yeah, he's right above my nose, 5,000 apparently, just crossing. But if he doesn't see me, I don't see him. I just. You said 030. Yeah, I'm back in that valley now. Got it. Am I? Yeah, I am. Oh, missile on me. Oh, no. Is it coming from your left? My front right. Front right. Might be able to dodge over the mountain. I'm looking behind me. I'm not seeing any uh, trails. Godspeed. Woo! Level magic, you up? One of my engines is down. Magic copies. Uh, advisory... 
Okay, he hit me. I got one engine. Cut it. You sure it came from your front right? Yes. I checked my RWR and that's where it was pointing to my one o'clock. Damn. Diving back down in the 030 valley. Okay. Jeez. I'm turn back around real quick. Maybe I can assist you, but I doubt it. I couldn't see him at all. I never saw a trail. Maybe IR? Maybe he was really close to me? Probably. I did get a... No, I got a RWR. No, locked, you though. wouldn't get a... Yeah, yeah. yeah. Damn, I've got a smoke trail right now. Uh, shut that engine down if you can. The affected engine. Okay. If it's still on fire, it could blow you up. Got it. It's a stupid. Last call sign uh, for magic, please say again. Okay, shut it down. Ooh, I might stall into some trees. I think this is it for me. Magic Hornet is turning cold. Um, be ready for oh. yourselves, otherwise you can get back to the valley. Uh, yeah, I'm stalling into trees. Mm, I couldn't make it over the mountain, no. <laughs> I'm down. I just got splashed by uh, that Hornet. Damn. That's tough. <laughs>